taking a look at a new math game called IC10 Math Game from Learning Resources, and it comes with lots of discs that have fish on one side and then a number, whoop, that's a shark, which we'll talk about in a second, numbers on the opposite side. So the idea is you take turns, oh, we keep getting a lot of sharks, you take turns flipping until uh, someone see, see, so you see 10, the, the 9, yeah. the 1, then you would take those two. Okay, but let's say I flipped over a shark, then that means that the shark and the tens I already collected go back into the box, and I've lost the opportunity to get that's, those points. That's bad. That's very bad. Okay, so we have a... Th okay. I, I see ten. I see ten, a three and a seven. Okay, okay. great, so, so you get that. <clears throat> so what I like about it is really is a... You have to think about it because you can put ten together with... Three cards. Two, three cards or four cards, however many cards you see to get to ten, or two cards, obviously. And then there's the shark aspect of it, which adds to the fun of play, depending on who you are. And then when you're done, in order to see who wins, you count up your pile of tens, and the person, obviously, who has the most points wins. So a very basic game. It's marked for ages six and up, which seems uh, actually actually right on target. Right on target. So a good game comes in a nice box, but you can take it out. Just take it in a bag for easy on-the-go math games.